Hi, this is my project on child restriction. Okay, so for my design, I wanted my Python bot to do the following. I wanted to detect when a child was on YouTube or games, and then I wanted to close the tab of their YouTube or game, and then it would deliver a random verbal warning. And I also wanted to have an admin override, so that way I was able to, like, let's say a kid wanted to watch a tutorial, then Fernando could type in he would be able to do a keyboard shortcut and it would turn on an admin override. And I also wanted to make sure it didn't, it would pause working on any .google.com uh, websites, such as Google Slides, Google Drive, so that kids could type um, whatever they wanted if they're creating a slideshow or anything else. So the libraries I used to do this were CV2, PyTesseract, the Time Module, PyAutoGUI, OS, GTTS, which I use for text-to-speech, random, which I used to get a random verbal warning, and keyboard, which I used to detect an, if an admin override was pressed, and then Pygame, which I used to say the random verbal warning like silently, without opening anything. And then this is my program. Uh, it's pretty big, but this part is, um, this part introduced all the libraries, and then this part right here, uh, made it so it detects whether an admin override is on or not. And then this part is kind of hard to see, but um, this actually detects if the um, a blocked word is inside the screen. And then this is just delivering the verbal warning. So test. So this turn it on. So that I want to go to, let's just say, so Yeah, that's a random verbal warning. Let's just to start off. So if I go to games, so play online games, free games online. And it has a small delay just because it can. Ha ha, don't make me call God. I have him on speed dial. It's just a random verbal warning. Uh, let's say I wanted to go to YouTube. There's an eight second delay. And then it just closes it. So it's a pretty effective way to do that. And then if I go to like um, Google Drive, my drive, this says YouTube on it, this folder, which means it should close it. But because it's on drive.google.com, it won't happen. So, And then if I do the admin override. Admin override enabled. You have five minutes of no restrictions. It would. Now I can use whatever I want for five minutes, and then after the five minutes is over, it'll say admin over disabled, and we'll just keep going. So yeah, that's it. And then it just sends the whole, um, if it doesn't work, it'll, if it does work, it'll show what the entire screen has, and if it does work, it also does that, but it'll squeeze the text. So yeah, any questions? Does it block games on Google, like Google Games? Google games? Uh, like what do you mean? Like uh, like Pac-Man or Tetris if you type in um, that on Google. Since you're blocking by domain. Or you uh, excluded. Well if Google I wanted Google. to go to this and then No no like this is yeah like that. Yeah, like this? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So if I turned it on it should work. So this Pac-Man is a game. If you search up like Pac-Man or Pac-Man Doodle. It'll automatically pop up with this, so it should. Oh, oh actually, mm. yeah. Right now it wouldn't work because it has this, but in the future I can make it so it only works on actual Google domain sites like .google.com. Mm -hmm. But right now, it's this. But all I have to do is just add a dot in front of the google.com. Mm -hmm. so. Any other questions? All right, let's give a round of applause.